Hi, my name is Bernie Hogan and I'm a Senior Research Fellow here at the Oxford Internet Institute. I teach a course called Online Social Networks. Now you might be thinking that this course is studying Facebook and Twitter, but it's actually studying an academic concept called structural analysis. Now this is where we think about the world in terms of networks. I mean, networks are everywhere, whether they refer to our friendships, connections between trade, between countries, uh, disease, transmission networks, or even memes. Well, the online world is an excellent source of relational data for networks. Every time someone retweets someone else, every time that there's a meme that floats through the internet, people's friendships on Facebook, these are all forms of data that we can ask questions about and kind of build out from the individual. So instead of saying, what is it about a person, say class or gender or their, uh, their wealth or their race, we, we don't just look at those attributes. We look at a person's context. We say, what about the number of friends a person has? What a, are people lonely online? Do people talk to a large audience or a small audience? And what difference does that make to who they, uh, who they communicate with and how they communicate? So since network is a really big paradigm, we can only scratch the surface of it. But we do so both theoretically, with a lot of readings and examples from past work, and also practically, by getting students acquainted with the tools and techniques of social network analysis. We go through some of the basics, we don't really assume uh, any prior knowledge of networks, but by the end of the course, we, uh, we typically, year on year, have students who have publishable level quality work being able to talk about how the relationships between people and between things online actually make a difference to the online world and to their sense of selves and to society.